Ooh, ooh, baby! Oh, mama! Hi! Welcome! Uh, wait for everything to, to load up and, and kick in. Are we good? Everybody hear me? Ooh, baby! Okay, good. Just checking. <laughs> Everybody can hear me. Everyone's tasty. Everyone's good. Welcome! We're finally doing it! The last episode of The Walking Dead. It's been a long time coming, and I honestly didn't think that it would actually happen, considering what happened with Telltale recently, so... I'm excited for this. I, I've heard good things about it. This came out the day I left for PAX. The day I was on a flight. And when I landed, people were like, Jack, the last episode of Walking Dead came out, are you gonna play it? I'm like, God damn it, right now, really? Um, so I'm here now. I, I decided to do it live, I decided I was gonna live stream it because, um, I, I could have recorded it today, but I, then I would have to edit it and then it would upload tomorrow, so I didn't want to waste any more time, I wanted to do it as soon as I was back, I came back yesterday, so I wanted to do it live today so we could all experience it together. So I know a lot of you probably know what's going to happen because it's been out for like a week and a half at this point, please be wary of spoilers, I won't be reading chat as I go through this episode, um, I might glance over it every now and then, I'm not sure, I can't promise anything because I I want to focus on the episode and a lot of people are going to be watching this afterwards. So, hi, anybody watching this as an archive on YouTube, this will be uploaded after the stream. Hello to everyone live as well. But I won't be reading chat because I don't want people to spoil the game for me as I'm going through it. Um, I've been purposefully like not reading the chat and people have said that people are spoiling it in chat already So I want to try and avoid that if you are very sensitive to spoilers I would also just be wary about people in chat spoiling it. So if you know what's happening, please be nice Please don't spoil it for other people. We're here to have a good time We're here to just hang out and watch the end of this story. This is the very last episode of The Walking Dead um the reason I call it the end of Clementine is because it's the end of Clementine's story. We're getting to the very end of all of Clementine's stuff that has built up to this point. So we've had four seasons of Clementine, and this is going to be the very final episode of her story. I don't know what's going to happen. I thankfully have not been spoiled, and I don't know what the end of the episode is going to pertain to, but I'm very, very excited to see what's going to happen. I have a feeling I'm going to cry. <laughs> um, I cried very heavily at the end of season one of The Walking Dead when Lee and Clementine's story was ending there. So, and my theories is that a lot of the sim, a lot of similar stuff is going to play out. They're going to like, they're going to tie it all up the way they kind of started it off, I feel, because the very first season was all about a paternal relationship between a guy and this girl who was not his actual daughter, and now we have Clementine and AJ, who's not her actual son. So I have a feeling a lot of very similar things are going to play out, but I, I legitimately have no idea. That's just kind of what I've been thinking in my head for the longest time. So I'm going to give people a couple of more seconds and a couple more minutes to get in as the, as the episode uh, gets ready. It did say... And I'm kind of annoyed by this, that I, I had issues, rec any of you who've watched my episode 3, it's, I had issues recording that because the game kept crashing and that was the time when my PC actually broke and I had to get brand new ones and everything and temporary PCs. But when I started this up, it said that I didn't have episode 3 completed, which we all know I did. So it said it's going to default some choices for me. So some of the choices that I made in episode 3 might not actually pan out in episode 4. Um, which I was upset about because the, the, uh, the choices that I pick are the choices I pick. I like playing the choices that I'm left with, but at the same time, I was not happy with the choices I made in episode 3. I kept saying through it, I'm like, I'm gonna just pick these choices anyway because I want this to happen and screw what things are- screw whatever happens to it. And then I went against that and I made some bad decisions anyway, so... If you've watched episode 3, you'd know that I didn't kill Lily because I didn't let AJ kill him, and then we got James killed? So that stuff might have reverted. So at this point, I'm like, if you make choices for me, you can't really make choices worse than the ones I already made. So I'm kind of okay with it. <laughs> um, so we'll see what it picks. I w I'm, I'm also kind of curious to see what it defaults to. So I think I have like half the episode done because my save files got messed up when I tried to like um, go to my laptop to try and get to where I was when the save file broke. So it's messing up a lot of stuff. But without further ado, um, let's start episode four. 
Okay, yeah, see, this. Unfinished episodes. Are you sure you want to start this episode? Choices will be auto-generated for unfinished episodes. We all know I finished episode three. We saw it. But I want to see what it picks for me. Anyway. And I just want to play episode four. I didn't realize that until I was starting up the stream, and I don't really have the time or the patience time, to go through it. <laughs> Since I can remember, Clem's always been there with me. She taught me to be careful, to be quiet, to be strong. To always aim for the head. <laughs> you sure did. To atone when I did something bad. To show mercy sometimes. I always listen to Clem. Always. But I've been thinking more. I don't know if she's right every time. She told me way back to shoot her if she got bit. That doesn't feel right. We're doing a lot of bad things <laughs> to save our friends, to protect our home. But when Clem told me not to shoot Lily, and she she killed Jane. Okay, so the same choice has happened. I'm mad, so mad. I don't, I don't know what I feel anymore. I don't know if Clem knows either. But I remember all the rules in the first one. Is never go alone. Always shoot for the face. Um, I'll bring my mic down a bit because the game volume is probably a little low to try and balance things out so I don't overpower things, but we'll get the gist of it as we're going through. Woo! Okay, so it picked the same, it, it did the same choices, so maybe it just didn't f completely finish out the episode. It still had the choices. Who knows? But I'm curious to see how this plays out now, even though the. I should have just killed Lily, but I'm curious to see if she'll die anyway. Because that's what these games always do. Flame, you got a cut on your on your chest. You're gonna get infected. Oh no! That's gonna be the biggest loss of the episode. <laughs> oh no, age! Hang on, I'm coming. The Titanic's going down, everybody. Women and children first. Oh, fucking spider clam over here! Oh lord! Get him! Grab him by the feet! Get them toes! AJ, you have to trust me. On the count of three, let go and I'll catch you. Oh, Jesus. Promise? Promise. Oh, God. It's like when Trico One, had to catch the boy two, in Last Guardian. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh, game of reflexes. It's from all that G fuel. Sorry. Ah, shit. Don't high five myself just yet. <laughs> okay. Off to a strong start. Now what? We need to find a way down. This ship isn't going to stay afloat much longer. <laughs> Perfect timing. There. We can climb down from there. We have to get there first. Yeah, why did you get into the boat? Okay, we've got to jump. I know it's far, but it's the only way. You're gonna have to toss me. Oh, cripes. You'll have to go first. You'll need a running start. I don't know, Clem. Don't tell the elf. You can do this! You can do this, AJ. Just run and jump. Big boy balls. You got this. I got this. I got this. AJ, what do we do when we're scared? Uh, hurry up. We push through it. We don't let it take over. No, we don't. You got this, Edge. Come on, Clem. Okay. 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 Ah, I pressed the wrong buttons. 
Do 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 do. I'm not going to leave you. She's Nathan Drake all of a sudden. Okay, game of reflexes. Hell yeah. Eat the boat! Zombie boat! Hug the wall. I love you, wall. <laughs> You're the best wall. No! Good lord. Sh stuff is on this boat! Age! I'm trying. VidCon. It's like, where do I go? Everybody's ravenous. Got something. <laughs> yeah, bad aim. That's what you got. Where do you think you're going? Okay. Wait, you're just walking out of here. Uh, what, what, what? Oh, there we go. Just throw it back at him. Oh, oh, shit, shit, shit. You are dead. Well, thanks for everybody for showing up and coming out to see this episode. Um, that's going to wrap it up for now. Ro roll the outro. Okay. Where do you think you're going? Uh, here again? It's okay. Shadows die twice. Wait, you're just walking out of here. arrows does this guy have? Why people think you just leave? Okay, give me them toes! Give me them wobbly knees! Ha-ha! Oh, cue it up! Cue it up! Oh, dick punch! Oh! Ah! Clem doesn't die in Infinity War. Ah, skin mask. There's only one, though, and it was in the water. Oh, wait, because of James. Yeah. Hey! No, oh, it's Lily. Yeah. Oh, shit! I wouldn't if I were you. You already had your chance. You said we were family once. Must have been why you couldn't. Uh, it was Let's just... both just turn around and walk away. Shoot her, Clem. She stabbed James in the back. <laughs> yep. Thanks. I'll need the ammo. Crap. <laughs> I was like, I'm not hesitating this time. Shoot her right through the eyes. My people will lose their war. They'll die because of you. Oh, well. The Delta was the first place I called home after years of wandering. <laughs> You're wasting arrows. It's a video game. Nothing lasts, Clementine. <laughs> Not friends. Everything Not burns. Love. Not the place you call home. They'll all fall eventually. Shoot her. Never forget that. Shoot me. Or they'll drag you down too. Come on, Clementine. <sighs> Third shot is you're supposed to get better. Fuck you, Clementine. Okay. That's right. That's right. What am I going to do? She kept missing. <laughs> Uncharted 5. All right. I've been on the road, killing zombies on the road. Willie Nelson also sings about a road. Got my boy, AJ. Sometimes I don't know where this dirty road is taking me. 
Gotta keep that sh- hair short, Clem. Sometimes I don't know the reason why. So I guess I'll keep gambling lots of moves and lots of rambling. Okay, so good start. Try to kill Lily anyway. Should have killed her last episode. Because you can kill her. And then James would be alive, but I don't really miss his. I'm still not alive. Thank you, Clem. But I am curious if they're just going to die anyway. I'm not reading chat. I'm not spoiling it. <laughs> don't spoil it for other people. Don't be a, don't be a dingus. Be smart, keep that hair short. Titanic 2. The Clemening. Oh, I thought that was Abel. But you ain't got no tongue. I'm really sorry about your tongue. But at least you're still alive. Nice move, Lewis. Keep it up. You have no idea how happy I am to see you right now. He can't talk. Bye bye! <laughs> Lewis lost his tongue, but he gained a rock and some courage. Are you okay? Yeah, my ass is a little singed, but I'm good. <laughs> Fuck. You, I was, I was so afraid you. Me too, but we're okay. We're both okay. She said, fuck you. <laughs> Lou. What happened to Minnie? <laughs> I, <don't know. laughs> I lost track after the explosion. Aim for the head. Oh, thank God. You guys made it. Fuck. There's more walkers than I can count. I don't the got that many fingers. Right to us. Stay cool. We knew this would happen. Mm -hmm. We just have to get off this beach. Huh, life's a beach. There! Look! We got the cart around. <laughs> Ruby, Willie! Come on! We're Howdy, y'all! Yeehaw and all that! Under these little shits! Put them down! But can't we be friends? Oh god, I thought he got killed. Shit! Club, do something! On it! <laughs> oh, not today, Neko. You. Good name, right? Is a shot him in the neck. Oh. If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. No, get away from her! Get away from her, you bitch! God damn! Dude, you want to squat in Apex? What the hell is she doing? She's gonna get herself killed. Probably. Oh, she's bitten. Oh my god. She's gonna die now anyway. Now. Everyone run for the cart. I'll stay back and cover you. I'll be right behind you. The second I see an opening, I'll make a break for it. Are we gonna save her? At least let her say bye to ten. I'll see you on the other side. Huh, yeehaw! Damn right. AJ, go with him. No, I'm staying with you. Thanks, kiddo. All right, remember how you shot Merlin? Do that to all of them. Yeah. 
shoot the walkers. That's the best idea you've had all day. Oh. I am a... Oh, I'm a machine! <laughs> Clementine! Fuck you! No! Shit! No! <laughs> oh, French fried titties. Oh my fucking gosh, she's fucking dead. Your knife is missing. Well, my life is about to be missing if I'm not careful. They're coming up the beach! Ten! Nine! Go. Eight! Seven! Oh lord. Oh, game just froze there for a second. Okay, 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 go. Ah, give me them knees! I call this one the Crippler. Cue ah, it up, cue it up, cue it up! That's it, sweep the leg. Nice, you. Time. What have you got? A knife! No! Okay. So far, so hunky daisies. Everything's going great so far. No one that I care about died. I'm not so sure a cave is the best option against zombies. Clint. Monsters, we need to move. A cave we'll is a terrible through. idea. We don't know where it goes. Well, we do know there's walkers in the other direction. But move it, dummy. <laughs> Out of my way, numb nuts. I mean, technically, you have an advantage. Because the squeezing through the long. fucking Junji Ito gap, but at the same time, the bodies will hit so the floor. In here. This sucks. <laughs> this really fucking sucks. I'll figure something out. Make a torch. <laughs> Light AJ's afro on fire. I just hold them up. <laughs> um. Okay. Well, I guess we live here now, boys. Grab stick. Okay. Need some way to start a fire. Mm, see what I mean? You could just keep killing them in the gap and eventually they'll stop coming through. Can I do that? Check out walkers. You guys doing okay? You want to you want a juice box? The whole cave is made out of flint! Perfect. Flint. I need something to burn. You just got a stick. And of course there's flint. Oh, and what's this? A J.O. crystal? It might look nice in our room. Just have to get home first. Okay, now is not the time to be worrying about what the fuck your room is going to look like. Mm, these might be nice curtains. Wasn't there another thing? The water's moving fast. Too dark to tell how far it even goes. Damn it, it's all too wet to burn. Just you need to keep your hair short anyway. Just cut off the little the little bun at the back and burn that. <gasps> Flammable mushrooms! Another one. Hmm. Gotta get home before AJ can play with it. 
Why are there toys in a cave? Hmm. Chunk of arm will work. All right. Okay, good. Look, there's another tunnel over there. It's too far. You're gonna have to toss me. No, we just gotta, we gotta find something to help us cross. Clip, the walkers are getting closer. You should help. You should. You should call Jesus. Jesus knows a thing or two about crossing. We'll be home before you know it. Jesus asserted his dominance with his original T-pose. I'm not sure where it goes, but it's our only option. Okay. Mm, rocks are too small to walk across. But they might stop something flowing down river. Uh -huh. <gasps> A log! If I yank that out of there, it would drift down the river and get caught in the rocks. It could work as a bridge. <laughs> Y'all ready? It's time to log the fuck on. By the power of Q! It just goes straight okay. down the river. We just need to go across one by one, and then we'll move the rocks out of the way. Uh, oh god, oh god! 10987! Ten. Ten, oh, thank god. James, no! Look at his face! Take that, you son of a beach! How flammable is a zombie? So now you wanna know. Okay. Pretty flammable! Yes! There's only one thing worse than a zombie! A flaming zombie! Just fucking go! Jesus Clementine, you really are a drama queen! Here we go, nice and easy from Clara. And the game crashed. <laughs> oh, magnificent. Fucking beautiful. This game runs like a dream. Ugh. It's like the 15th time that this game has crashed on me total. I'm trying to launch it again and now it won't launch. I love The Walking Dead. Have I told you guys that? It's amazing. All right, it's going to it's going to get me it's going to have to get me to do that whole section again, isn't it? Please no. Please don't. Cuz that's the thing about these games as well. It's like, yeah, if you're going to crash, that's fine, but it makes you restart entire sections again. It's going to put me back at the start of the cave. I'm gonna have to do all that again, and it just takes so long, and you can't skip any of the dialogue, and you can't skip any of the cutscenes. We're not! We're fucking fine! I lived, bitch! Thank God. <laughs> Alright. Nothing happened. Live edit that out. Clem crashed it. She was too good. Her skills were too strong. It's probably going to crash multiple times in this episode, but as long as it puts me right back where I was. All right. Nice. Game was like running along, and it was like, "Ah, things are going too well." Yeet. Messed itself up. Great. We 
Three stalag might be fucked here. But those moves were stalag tight. Alright, which way do we go? Ten, do you see a light down any of these tunnels? What's up? AJ, still with me? AJ, please. We have to keep moving. There's... There's nothing after this. What? James isn't in there. He looked right at me. And... And his eyes were empty. There's nothing after we die. Except fun with your zombie friends. Nothing but empty eyes. AJ, I know he was your friend, and I know this is terrible. Please don't say you're sorry. Okay. <gasps> Why did you make me make my friend go away? Oh. Okay. Everything is just, just wrong. Like something spilled on the floor and you just can't get it back. Because you didn't let me shoot her. Alvin Jr., you're acting out. You're not a baby anymore. AJ you will remember soft, that. But everything that you do just messes up my head. Be strong. Be brave. If something wants to hurt us, shoot it right in the head. <sighs> AJ. When we were talking with Abel, you stabbed him and stopped him from becoming a monster. You made killing look so easy. AJ, please, that's enough. I'm sorry. I'm just scared something will take you away. Aren't you scared of that too? Having to leave the world behind? And me? Listen, kiddo. Everyone Be is realistic scared with them. of what happens after. Especially if it's nothing. I don't want people I care about to leave, Clem. I have to kill anyone that tries to take them away. I do. I believed you when you called me a murderer about Marlin. I don't think that murder means the same thing as it did when you were little. In a world that's gone now. Yeah, he's right. I think that murder now is just protecting the people around you. Ugh. Murder is a thing that makes us safe. <laughs> Some part of me wants to say you're right. Maybe words do change. And say I'm right. I know you want to be big for everyone, but... You're just a kid, like me. Sometimes you're scared, just like any other kid. What age is Clementine in this? So I'll help. You said all the policemen and firefighters died. So I'm going to be a new one. A fireman? Even if I don't get it just right, I am. <laughs> because all it means is killing bad people who hurt other people. And I'm good at that. What made you want to become a policeman officer? Like, I think I could be the best at killing bad people. <laughs> Better than you, even. Because I wouldn't hesitate. I think you'd be a good firefighter. I won't hesitate, but bitch! Can you not be so angry? What do you mean? Our new firefighters can't be as angry as you get sometimes. I need you to trust me, Clem. 16, 17, jeez. And the bad people apart. That I know when to use my gun. And that you'll let me decide for my own. Yeah, I think me trying to hold him back and trying to teach him is what's making him angry and then things get worse because of that. So just actually giving him the freedom to do what he wants might make him better. Or completely worse, but then we get a cool super villain origin story. Okay. Really? Firefighters have to make the hard calls. 
which means they deserve our trust. And if they kill to protect others, they're never happy about it. Your relationship with AJ has changed. Killing people doesn't make me happy, Clem. Watching the life drain from their eyes does. Feel that? Yeah, that's the way out. Come on. Wait, how did they get across the river? That's what I want to know. Oh, I got an achievement. One, red water. Wed rotter! <gasps> How convenience! Now it's a fun little lollipop that you could eat. AJ seeks your approval above all else. Sounds a little fucking needy if you ask me. You've strengthened his confidence in himself. He just murders ten. He's like, is clear. He was a bad guy. If the shore is that way, then the school is probably that way. Hmm. I don't like the way AJ's looking at him. Sim was the third. Huh? The day after AJ killed Marlon, you already know Violet and I voted for you to stay. A Sim was the third vote. Oh. Wait, that means Omar voted us out? And Ruby? Uh, yeah. Assholes. Huh. What made you think of that? A Sim said you knew how to survive. He could just tell the school would be safer with you there. I voted for you because I liked you. But his reason, it was better. Hmm. I just, I just thought you should know. Asim was right. We were safer. We were more scared than we let on when you met us. That's really nice of you to say, Ten. Thank you. That's okay. Now that we're out of danger and going back home, it just made me think of it. It's real soft boy like hours out here. If Marlon was still in charge, we'd be taken away to wherever, or dead. Instead, we fought back, because you showed us how. Hmm. We weren't safe with Marlon, even in his safe zone. We were just hiding. <gasps> It's a spooker man's! Huh? I'm not jumpy, you're jumpy! Hey! Purple! I mean, Violet! Violet! Yeah, I, I knew that. You made it. You're all alive. We must smell atrocious. I couldn't believe you were really dead. I had to try and find you. You did find me. You got nice hands. Did everyone else escape? Yeah, they're okay. They took the cart and headed back to the school. Sick. We're safe, Clem. All we gotta do now is find our way home. What? Any idea which way that is? I know an old bridge near here. If we cross it, we won't be too far from the school. Nice. Do you think there's socially anxious zombies? Because they all have to hang out in groups all the time. Do you think some of them are like, Hi, I don't really want to be friends with you, but I was kind of, I was forced to be. My name's Zed.
Oh, uh, yeah, you lost a finger. How's your hand feeling? It'll be fine once it scabs over. <laughs> How's your hand feeling? Well, the pain's about a four out of five, if you ask me. <laughs> At least I can still flip people off. Silver lining, I guess. <laughs> nice. Well, we were looking for you guys, and I... I thought you might be gone for good. Oh. Shit. Shit my pants. I was trying to figure out what I'd do if you were gone. And I realized how goddamn stupid I was about Minnie. For a whole fucking year. I was so wrapped up in losing her and Sophie, I pushed away everyone who tried to care about me. Marlon, Brody, Lewis, even you and AJ, I, I, I tried my damnedest not to care about either of you. Because you were afraid of losing someone else. It's understandable. I was a goddamn coward. I'm not a coward anymore. Well, you have to be a coward before you can be brave. Otherwise, how else will you know Jesus. what bravery is? Everything's so different now. Me, us, the school. I remember how Marlon described it and what we were going to turn Erickson into. It's not the way any of us pictured it. Mm. How did you picture it? I guess I couldn't. I just listened to what Marlon said. How it would be a home. A real one, but I couldn't really wrap my head around it. My family lived in a trailer. My family died. Mm, what about you? Where'd you live? I lived in a house with my mom and dad. Fence around it, big backyard. What was your favorite part of the house? My parents being alive. I had a treehouse in the backyard. I used to take my walkie-talkie up there and play for hours. I'd pretend it was a ship and I was the pirate captain, or it was an igloo and I was a hunter, <laughs> or a castle and I was a princess. Really? Like with frilly dresses and a tiara? Yeah, but also a sword, a warrior princess. Like Xena. Yeah, obviously. And that treehouse kept me alive when all this started. That's where I hid. You're really judging me for my choices when I was nine? <laughs> you know, Erickson can still be the home Marlin promised. As soon as we get back, we'll start rebuilding. <sighs> It'll be a lot of work, but you're right. It is worth it. Hell, we could even put in a treehouse. We've already got a bell tower. Okay, we'll build a bell tower house. Perfect. After all that's happened, it's still hard to imagine. I mean, we fought for it. Defended it. It should feel more like home than ever, but it doesn't. You know what the problem is? That stupid fucking name, Erickson. Why? You want to rename it? <laughs> yeah. Fuck that guy. We should name it something cool. The rotting shithole. Threatening, but not like scary. Happy Sunshine Land. Something that makes assholes go. I should stay away. Let's let's see this. But not like blood murder knife house. You name it. It was your idea. Texas. We're calling it Texas. You can't just name it Texas. That's already a place, Violet. Fine. Texas too. <laughs> I want to help rebuild our school. Texas too. <laughs> it's already picked, Ten. Shut the fuck up. You will, Ten. It's Texas too. We all will. We can start as soon as we get back. Let's get home to Texas too. That's a stupid name. Why did I choose that option for you to name it? Texas 2, the double fuck you. Everything's even bigger now. <laughs> oh. It's almost as bad as how Boston names its streets. 
We were in Boston for PAX and everything was like A Street. Turn left on F Street. Okay, just take your time and keep moving so forward. What can we call the streets? I know, we have an alphabet. Let's just put it down as that for now and then we'll figure something out later. And then somebody was like, I'm picking A Street. It's like, damn it, that's fucking good. Let's just use that. And then everything else is just named after English things. Shoo, birds! Shoo! They're zombies! Run! Or fly, whichever you prefer. Something's gonna happen when I step on this truck. <laughs> Nothing really happened when I stepped on the truck. Well, something's definitely gonna happen now, because now you're walking real slow. Oh, mama, shimmering, sharpening death. Oh, not, That's far. nothing happened when you guys stepped on the truck really either? Far. Should be able to jump it. It's not that You're gonna have far. to toss me. <laughs> yeah, I think we can. We just gotta be careful not to land too hard. Okay, that's a heaping help of fuck no juice right there. Oh god, it's undead, not dead mini. Didn't she get bitten? <gasps> Dying, Ten. Yes. Yes, I am. I'm finally going someplace better. Is that further from us? Because I, I would like you that. There with me. Where everyone gets to be a person again. Oh, cheers. We're gonna go be with Where everyone Mom knows your name. And Dad. And Sophie. Together. Ten, look at me. I know that looks like her, but your sister is gone. I'm... Okay, this is bad. This is real bad. Please, please, Minnie, stop. He needs to be with his family. Don't do this. Don't worry, Ten. She can try to stop me. But I am not going anywhere without you. The night will be over soon. Oh, shit. Good job, H. Does she have Herschel's gun and she just never runs out of ammo? I'll help the boys across the gap. You're gonna have to Watch toss me! The walkers. You have bows and arrows? Why didn't you just fuck her up? Uh there's one. Uh there's two. Oh, okay, okay. There we go. Yeehaw! For Texas too. Shit. I died. Okay. <laughs> cool. Um. Fuck. The night will be over soon, indeed. Get down. Uh. All right. Priorities. Priorities. Here I'll we go. The boys across the gap. Watch out for the walkers. You think? Okay. One. Two. What? All right. Get down. Just let me skip this part and start with the shooty bangs again. 
boys across the gap. You do that. Watch out for the walkers. Are shooting again? Oh, down you go. Christ! I thought she finished shooting. Get down! Ugh. Wait, can I see her in the crowd? I'll help the boys across the gap. Watch out for the walkers. Okay, maybe I can hit her. I wasn't. I wasn't looking for her. Is she there? Ah! Okay, okay. Where is she? There she is. Stop doing this now. This part isn't fun. End it. Yes. I got AJ across, but ten will budge. I have to stop her. Okay, here we go again. Ah, oh, God! Oh, my perfectly sculpted face. Okay, okay. Put a little boot up on the countertop. Shit. You are not his family. Ooh, out of boules, I see. You're just something in my way. Yes. Yes, queen. Yes. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, dick move. dead if he hadn't taken that shot. You think that's okay? Just gunning down one of our own. I didn't want to shoot him. He was my first real friend. Oh, he was messing up again, just like when he got Mitch killed. So I had to decide. Clem said I could, so I did. <laughs> Hi. Goodbye, Tom. Oh, Christ. <laughs> Clem, your leg is all open. Your leg is like a 7-Eleven right now. I know. I'll climb first, and I'll catch you on the way down. 
No, I'll clam first. Come on. Bye. Shit. I got it. Clem, look out. Oh shit. Oh god. Thank you. Oh, oh this Run. is not it's good. But we'll make it. Go. <laughs> I have a fucked leg right now. <laughs> she throws it back on top of herself. I got you. Oh, please be okay. Please be okay. Please be okay. after this. Oh, please don't let Clementine turn! I don't want her to Clement turn! those boots. Just axe, straight to the kneecap, go. <laughs> I don't want to look at it! No! Ah, it's just a flesh wound. Well, at least if we need to identify who did it, we have his dental records now. I got bit. No. Oh god, I told him that if I get bit, he has to shoot me. Come on. We can't stay here. <sighs> Just Keep use the forward. axe. Keep moving forward. Keep moving. Oh. oh god. Use the axe, take the leg, and go. Keep moving forward. I mean, your leg is all messed up right now. You're gonna bleed out anyway. It's either bleed out or turn. So just take the leg, risk it, and go. Oh, I, I got an achievement that said goodbye. I don't like that. You wait, the further it spreads. Wait, has it even been, been established in this universe? I can't remember that if you chop it off that you can get away from it. Do this to me. Don't ever forget that. Oh, 
I love you too, Clem. Keep moving forward. This fucking sucks. Look! James is boring. It's empty now. Oh, yeah. He's safe in there. <laughs> so safe. Run now. Can I just make a suggestion and say run everywhere all the time? Okay, nice. Oh, mother of God. Move! Go, E.J., run! I'm right behind you. Oh, I'm sweating like a hooker in church. Uh, ah! <laughs> I hate this! No! Oh, shit! Good shot, kid! If we try, just the two of us, you and I. Uh, no, no, my barn. You, stay out. Thank you. No, Occupado! This is the worst! I can't queue fast enough! Because there's a whole queue of them outside. Hello! Hi! There we go. The power of two. We could have the power of ten, but he's dead. We need to find something to stick between the handles. Don't use the axe. Bar the door. Oh, I'm controlling AJ now. The goods. Atta boy, AJ. Kill the boy, become the man. It's not good. It's not good. Great still. Here we go, nice and quick. <laughs> Here's Johnny. Okay, go time. My heart's beating real fast right now. Ah, oh, Christ. I need the knife. Fuck him up! 
yourself. Nice shots. Hey, Bales. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. It's go time. Yes, kid, yes! I don't like that it's suddenly letting me control AJ. It's like it's preparing me. I don't like that. Oh, like a surgeon! I can get inside. You fucking think? That was a weird set of QTEs. Okay, okay. I'm shaking and crying right now. Go for the knees. Good job, AJ. You did it. Thank you. Now what? You need to find a way out of here. We can climb up there. The monsters can't reach us up there. Let's go. Easy climb. Come on. Please, try. You can't give up. You can't give up. I need you. I need you. Fuck. I'm so sorry, kiddo. It's exactly like Clem and Lee. This is just what happens sometimes. But it wasn't supposed to happen to you. <laughs> My little goofball. No. It's Alvin Jr. You'll always be goofball to me. Hey, look at me. AJ, please. You're such a cutie. How did I get so lucky? Silly right now. Not right now. Please. I just wanted to see you smile. One last time. <laughs> Don't say that. Please. Don't say that. I need to make sure you remember. Remember what? The rules. What's number one? Never go alone. So, so I can't leave. Not without you. AJ. It's your rule. You won't be alone. Not for long. Get back to the school. I don't know how. Sure you do. One of the first things I ever taught you. You need to make sure they can't smell you, so... Fresh, juicy walker just waiting to be gutted. Grab that axe. You know what to do with it. Yeah, cut the leg! Come. Clem, 
AJ. Shoot them in the head. Got any more ammo? There isn't any more. Oh, God. <sighs> okay, then. Fuck. And the last rule. I, I want to stay with you. I know what'll happen. And I don't care. I don't want to go. I just want to sit next to you and... stay. Like that monster couple from the train station. Even if someone kills us later, we'll just sit for a really long time. Please. Stay. Oh, sorry, kid. But no. I have a job for you. I need you to get back to your room. I need you to sleep in your bed and have friends and grow tall. Taller than I ever was, I hope. I need you to live, AJ. For me. That's your job now. Okay, Quill. That's my job. Last rule. No! What do we do if I get bit? <laughs> That fucking sucked. It's a flashback. AJ, I'm coming. Oh god, are you gonna make me feel feels again? <sighs> I knew it! It was exactly like Lee and Clem from season one. I can't even remember what I did during that scenario. Is this where we got AJ back? Bitch. Fort McCarroll. Where is he? I'm looking for a boy. He's about three years old. His name's Alvin Jr. 
I mean, yeah, what, what did you expect? You know what? Fuck this. You made me cry. You made me cry my own tears. Please. Oh, Anakin, is that you? Where are the children? It hurts. Oh my god, it hurts so bad. Why would he answer your questions? Kill me. Okay. And then episodes four, five, and six never happened. Take some of that shit. Another one? Ah! At this point, I'm just like, kill everything! If Clem's dead, I don't care anymore. Ah! You stupid asshole. I'm not messing around. Tell just... me where the kids are. All right, all right. That way. There's a nursery, but I'm not letting one of you savages take a kid! Ah! <laughs> you don't spook me! I got a... I got a quick trigger finger! Clem's a machine! This is like when Joel got separated from Ellie. We ended up using? I can't remember what it looked like. Sorry. Sorry. So sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry, bang, bang, sorry. Don't worry. Seemed nice, but you were gonna shoot first. Oh, in the cheek! Whew. She was just a wet nurse. <laughs> to church because you seem very holy. I have a feeling some of these characters are characters that I've seen before, but it's been so long Gigi. since I've played the previous seasons. It's me, Clem. What's up, Potato? Look, I got your name on my hand. Aww. He's so much younger there. Ah, she was like that when I got here. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get you out of here, okay? No. Oh. She fought so hard for him. Because one of the options was like, I fought way too hard for this, for him to die with her. So I guess that's why it's like recontextualizing some of that stuff. Now this is like a double whammy though. You're doing this after? Really? My emotions. Was she going with a baby bottle for AJ? He's way too old for that.
That's it, kiddo. Just wipe the blood off your face. Like every child has to do eventually. I'm still sad I lost my hat. <laughs> somehow look older here than she does oh there's that beautiful little potato face okay now where to can't go back to Richmond this whole area is a war zone gotta Go fast. Yeah, we have to go, AJ. This place, we can't stay here. It's not safe. But it's okay. We're survivors. And the first rule of survival is never go alone. <laughs> never g go alone. Clem? <laughs> yeah, that's right. AJ? Oh. I've really missed you. No. So much. I know where we'll go. We'll go find ourselves a new home. Together. And I'll never leave you again. Yeah, hi, Skybound? Yeah, it's me, uh, Jack. Yeah, fuck you! <sighs> hey, where did all the zombies go? Oh, this is much after. Fish. Looks like a meal. Are you my dog now? Whoa. Who's a good girl? Different choices. Is you Rosie? Goodest girl in the world. It's true. She has a certificate to prove it. Here, fishy, fishy. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> boom, boom is what I do in my pants. All right, girl. I'm gonna go put this beer away. Stay here and keep watch. Oh, wait, is this not the barn? Oh. Never mind. I thought this was the barn that we left them at. <sighs> I knew it, because as soon as you got to that barn, it let me control AJ, and it was setting me up for this. It looks like a bad place to sleep. But a great place to wash up. Oh, 
a little age. Nothing good. I'm an alcoholic now. Life's been tricky. Hi, my name's AJ. I'm ten years old and I'm an I alcoholic. Tell Willie this is here in case we need more bombs. You're probably wondering how I got here. V plus M. Violet plus Minnie. Mm-hmm. She used to be their friend. How can someone just make that go away? This place is c cursed. Oh, that's scary <laughs> and mean. Yeah. I think this place is good. Maybe, maybe let's take that down. That's a pretty good. Better than the ground. Uh, facts. It's getting kind of cold. I'll bring some sticks and stuff next time. I like your Gandalf staff. Okay, now what? Go outside? Is this how it's gonna be now? Is that we're gonna get more telltale? <gasps> the hat! It lives! Oh shit! No! Fuck! Please give me another chance! Please give me another chance! Please give me another chance! No! Shit, 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 shit! No, I want it, I want it, I want it! No, no! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! I. Rosie! You're the yes. goodest girl! The best in the world! Good girl! It's wet and it smells bad, but it doesn't matter. It's home. <sighs> oh shit. Oh no, is that 10? Oh fuck. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, uh... Always aim for the head. It's not him anymore. You can't shoot though here. I'm sorry, Ten, but at this point... Sorry, Ten. <laughs> I know. Me too. Let's go home. Oh, Rosie. Let's go home. The dog's name is Rosie, isn't it? Got an achievement that says time bomb with a picture of the hat. Oh, I thought it was gonna end there for a second. The top, the crags and cliffs, the air is thin So you'll find a mountain path on down the hill mm, These suns are nice Meet me where the snow melt blows This is another reason to live stream it as well Because these songs are probably going to get claimed afterwards And sometimes it blocks it everywhere again. Dude, sick trick shot! Dude, perfect! Get out of my fish bucket, you stupid leaf! Braiding hair. Last year's antlers. Mark the trail. Ah, Ruby. Take us back, go, oh, take us back. So now we get to see who survived. Yeehaw! Okay, a sim, Ruby. Take us back on Other characters take whose names I forget. Oh, take that's cute. Us, take us back. Sisters 
name Omer? There was Omer and a Sim. <laughs> Wait. Don't fuck with us and they just have Abel's body? <laughs> That's real messed up. And Mitch? No. He got Mitch got killed. What's the young dude's name? I can't remember. He knows the fiddles cry. Violet's still alive. Bob Maker Kid, I'm gonna call you that. Howdy, bitch. Our songs like fallen rain. Wind blown buildings. Come on, doggo. Muddy ground. <laughs> AJ. The oh, Willie, that's his name. I should have remembered that because I kept making fun of it. <laughs> Thanks, chat. end there as well. I was like, don't... I want more closure than this. I want to hear characters talk to each other again. I don't know how everybody feels towards one another. Oh, we going we gonna get some good eats. What you doing there, goofball? Oh, easy there. Yes! You're out of bed. You're walking. Oh, thank you have fuck! Weak arm legs. Crutches. Crutches. Oh, this is the best timeline. I found your hat. It was in the creek down by the. Oh, ship. nothing was lost. Was Rosie jumped right in and got it out of the water. It's all wet now. You made me cry! It's definitely seen better days. You know what? You keep it if you want it. Oh my god, I'm so happy. I'll put it in our room. I have a surprise for you too. Come with me. You I alive is surprise enough! Oh. oh, you got a little stump now, Clem, but that's okay. Jeez, you cut at the shin? You didn't even cut at the knee joint? Couldn't get the shin is so much harder and more painful. Oh, thank God. So, what do you think? I'm so happy. It's is for me. Yep, Willie helped me put it together. Come on, let me push you. Oh, Clem, you can do anything you want now. I'm just so glad you're alive. Oh, so it wasn't exactly like season one. You just set it up that way. Again, I reiterate, Skybound, fuck you. But also... <laughs> oh, Jesus. This is my favorite day ever. This is fun. I love today. Me too. Me too. It's good to see you smile. Thanks, Clem. I'm just so happy right now. Food's ready, everyone. Come and get it. I forgot about all the people I killed now. You're the best, Clem. I agree. It's gonna get cold! You just said it was ready. Oh, I'm so glad Come I on. let's go eat. I'm so glad I let him make his own decisions. We're coming! Oh. oh, my beautiful, dysfunctional orphan family. <laughs> I love Willie. Okay. 
We worked hard for this food. And you're just gonna throw it at each other? <laughs> Lewis is like, I still don't have a tongue, by the way. <laughs> he's like, in his head, he's like, tastes great. I don't know. were out there! <laughs> God, it sounds like Titus is laughing Final Fantasy X. Seconds, please! Already? Did you even taste that? Blah, 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 blah. He still can't talk. <laughs> Idiot. I'm so happy. Ugh. Yeah, that's the spot. A sim says he saw 10, 15 of them, a little bit past the old I you were gonna say you saw I 10. you to go. You're the boss. We need to know who they are. Maybe even see if they're willing to trade. Just keep your distance until you can make a call. Who, who are? A group of survivors out beyond the old safe zone. Some kind of caravan. Are they bad people? How about you back me up, and we'll find that out together. Word on the street is you're a good running buddy. Best. Sending Violet smart. She knows what she's doing. That gotcha, kid. That's why I want you to come with. It'd make me feel a lot better if you went. No. He's got responsibilities now. This is the part where you tell me you'll be really, really careful. No. Oh. My beautiful family. You okay? Just, just getting tired. Hey, walk with me a sec. I'm coming back up like, I lived, bitch! <laughs> oh, so glad she didn't die. She give her a cool, like, mechanical leg. Katja. Uh, sorry. <sighs> it's okay. I stare at it too. If it was just you and me alone out there, and I was like this, I don't know if I'd make it two weeks. I'm gonna need these to go anywhere. And if we ever had to run... It wouldn't be pretty. We're done running. You made it so we don't have to run, Clem. We're safe now. Yeah, I guess we are. Go. Oh. That dog's head is massive. All this. It's worth it. All those times you would ask me if we'd find a home. All I could ever tell you was, we'll see. And your face would fall every single time. Oh. It's better than saying yes and lying to me. And that's what I told myself. But you want to know something I didn't tell you? I never had a plan. I never knew where we were going. I never knew anything. I just fought and fought and fought and hoped you didn't notice. Hope we'd find something before you did. Did I do a good job? 
<laughs> of course you did. What are you? Are you crazy? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe a little. A lot more than a little. Time's been kicking ass for we years. Were in the barn. You didn't listen to me. And if you had, I'd be dead. I was right to trust you, back in the cave. To make the hard calls, even when I couldn't. You'll have to be strong for the both of us. Wait, so can Clem just die and, like, not come back? Is that an you ending? So I can. That would suck! So, thank you. For everything. You're welcome. For everything. <sighs> oh, now end. Oh, no, that would have been a nice ending, just a smile. Oh, dead Clem isn't an ending. So you, she can't actually die. Oh, just playing with my heartstrings, my emotions. Oh. Oh, that's cool. Still not bitten, team. That's a really cool way of doing credits. That's very creative. Oh, The final season. It's weird that they're still calling it the Telltale series. I know that it started off as the Telltale series, but it's not the Telltale series anymore. It's Skybound. Okay, okay. Here but I guess go. a lot of the Telltale team are still working on it, so... Credits, credit where credits do, I guess. You can now place collectibles in your room. Okay, but... I don't really care about collectibles. Aw, oh, Ten's drawings. It's too bad he won't be able to draw another one. I hope you have extra crayons wherever you are, Ten. Too bad I killed him. Remember when he was alive? I sure do. Hmm. You know what? I'm a great artist. <laughs> I thought he was gonna say, Can you hear me, Rosie? Oh, Rosie, yeah. Oh, great. I thought he was gonna say, hmm. I suck at drawing. It's put, so cool looking. Put my little geode on the table. I wonder if it has magic powers. Oh, put Clementine's hat by the window when you're done. Hey, another hey, one to add to my group. Junior, you ready to rock? Are you ready to rock? I said, are you ready to rock? Okay, we can look at all these things, but... Oh, look at Rosie, the best one. The goodest girl. Hi. <laughs> All right, folks, this is it. The last time. It all ends here. gonna end on a shot of her hat. I'm coming.
sweet. I like that. Oh, okay. So the episode was called Take Us Back. That was good. That was really, really good. That was a good last episode, I feel. There was no, like, stupid, like, bring down moments where we were just, like, in the room chatting or anything like that. It was just straight to the point. It kept the action coming. It picked its moments to have the conversations, but it never, like, took you out of it. It just kept pushing forward, and I really like that. Really high emotional value, really high emotional content. Okay, can you just calm down for a second? Really high emotional content really made me feel those moments. The stuff with Clem, I think, was really well handled. Um, reminded me a lot of season one with Lee. Really, really good. I'm glad that it ended happy. I'm glad that it didn't end with her dying, because that was something that everyone predicted from the... from the start of this season, because they kept, per like, saying that it was the end of Clementine's story, so everyone was like, okay, so she's gonna die. Um... And I'm really glad we got to see the end of it, even after all the nonsense that happened with Telltale, and even though all of that drama and shit happened, I'm really glad that Skybound picked it up and we got the last two episodes, so really appreciative of them for doing that. Um, thanks to everyone for hanging out in the stream, by the way, and watching this live with me. It's really, really fun to do this live. It's really fun to do this with the audience as it's happening. Maybe with these, like, choice-based games, I'll do this more often. This was a little different because I got late to this episode, so a lot of people in chat knew what was happening already. Um, so I kind of had to avoid that, but doing it live with people is fun to like glance over and see people's reactions to things as they're happening. So as episodes come out for stuff, I might do that from now on with like Life is Strange or if there's any more Walking- Oh well, I don't know if there's gonna be more Walking Dead. It might be just done under a different name instead of Telltale. So we might get more Walking Dead games like this with AJ and stuff, so... Who knows? But I'm really glad we got to the end of that. Um, and any of you watching after the fact on YouTube as a- as a VOD after the archive... I thank you guys for watching as well and supporting this type of series and supporting the Walking Dead episodes on this channel because the Walking Dead has kind of been a staple of the channel for a long time and doing these like one-off episodes, so thanks for that. I appreciate it and doing these doing these longer story-driven types of games is really fun and I'm glad that this is still a thing that we can do on YouTube and it hasn't lost its touch yet. Really high emotional content on the channel, but that episode I really liked. Uh, wait, so what happened to Lily? This this is the thing that bothers me about these choice-based games. It's like, you either kill her in the last episode, or she just disappears in this one. And then everyone, at, in the last episode, everyone was like, Jack, you made the wrong decisions, and like a big bunch of dislikes come in, which, I don't know, you can't really make right choices in these ones. E well, even I felt like, okay, I should have probably killed Lily. But then it was like, Okay, James came back for one scene in the cave, and Lily just disappeared, so it's like, okay, so there's no fucking point whether I kill them or not. They're just not here anyway, so who cares? It's hard to do a choice-based game and have the decisions actually matter going into the next one. So, it's very superficial kind of stuff. It's like a scene or two. It's like, what happens with James then? Does James just die anyway? In this episode, if you don't kill him in the last one? I don't know. I, I, I just dislike that. I don't like that they do that with choice-based games. But at the same time, it's very hard to do that. It's go it, it would take you years to like make episodes otherwise. If you really want to have proper branching narratives, like Detroit Become Human has a lot of branching narratives and that took, what, six, seven years to make, if not more? So... I don't know. Oh, he actually has a scene? Okay, well that's better then. Um, but to have, to actually have these things weave in and make really big... Like... Like, the ending for everybody now seems like it would probably kind of be very similar. Just some characters are there or not. So, it's hard to make them really stand out. 
Something like Undertale does choices really well. Because it doesn't make them choices, so to speak. It lets the player just play organically. And if stuff happens, then it's like, oh shit, this is just a part of the game. But that's the version of the game you get. You don't know that. Whereas in this, these types of games, it's like, oh, they're dead, by the way. Remember that. Or they're not, so. Hopefully we can get some better stuff. I know. Overall, I really liked it. I thought it was great. I thought it had really good moments. And they handle it really well. I'm happy with the way the final episode lasted. Anyway, let's see my choices. You and 64% of players trusted AJ. Wow. 36% didn't want him to do that. You and 64% of players let Violet re rename the school herself. 10% said Happy Sunshine Land. 12, The Rotting Shithole. And 14, Castle Violet. I would say these ones suck, but we got Texas too. 77% of players asked AJ to kill you rather than let you become a walker. You and 60% of players shot 10 after he became a walker. Again, at that point, you have the emotional moment. You have the moment when you shoot him in the neck already. So you're sad about that. So when he's a walker, it's like, well, it doesn't matter then at that point. He's just a liability and a, a thing that can harm the rest of your group. So, of course, just sh shoot him again. Okay. James is thankful that you respected his beliefs. Okay, James is dead. 85% of players left Lewis feeling shaken and tongueless. Uh, 10 is dead. I wish you would let me know how many people got 10 killed. 50% of players left Lily feeling shamed. 50%, half and half. That's pretty cool. Uh, you and 12% of players left Violet feeling loved. Well, I guess it's either Lewis or Violet, so that statistic splays a whole lot more. Ah, oh, I got three out of four. Oh, Jesus. What Clem taught me. The first thing you do when you enter a new place is check all the windows, always aim for the head. We were hearing all of these things as we went through anyway. Whenever you're scared, just try to push through. Uh, a lot of very generic things. The hard calls are always unfair. Firefighters have to make the hard calls. Your choices. Episode 1. Okay, we've been through these. I know how these things played out. I did do the episodes. Hmm. All right. That's it. That's the end of Telltale's The Walking Dead. This is the final season of the whole game. This is the final season of all of the Telltale stuff. Hence the title, The End of Clementine, because it's the end of her story. I don't... I think they're just ending it there. I don't think we're getting anything else. Maybe we'll get a different type of game. Maybe... Well, I was going to say maybe they'll move away from the, like choice-based version of this game, but at this point, they have to. You can't keep doing this type of game. There's a reason Telltale got closed down is because you did too much of the same thing and took on too many licenses and then too many of the same types of game revolved around too many licenses. And people, like, gamers want different things. If you're making sequels to things, you gotta keep it fresh. You gotta change some things. So, if you're gonna do more Walking Dead stuff, which I absolutely hope you do, maybe we'll get a bigger budget Walking Dead game. That'd be cool. I mean, these are a uh, pretty big budget, but at the same time, I want, like, a really big, like, Last of Us type of game. Um, and that was the type of thing, like, Last of Us came out and did a Walking Dead game better than The Walking Dead did, did The Walking Dead. So, a lot of people just kind of felt the burnout on it and the frustration of the game and the fatigue. So, please, keep The Walking Dead stuff going, but change it up a little. Let's see what you got. Let's let's go further with it. Um, but maybe people are just kind of burned out on The Walking Dead and zombies anyway. I think the TV show itself has burned people out because the series is just not what it was. But whatever. We'll, we'll save that conversation for a different day. But thank you guys for hanging out and joining me. Um, again, during the live stream, I wasn't able to read chat because of spoilers. And I want to just focus on the episode um, because for the people watching it back afterwards I don't want to constantly be reading chat and then coming back here and back and forth kind of thing because it makes people feel left out um, but thanks for being here anyway I appreciate it um, I had a blast I thought that this was a really fun stream thank you for anybody who was doing super chats or memberships or anything like that I'm sorry that I missed them now but again as I said I couldn't read for spoilers because those are some pretty big spoilers so I'm sure 
people were ruining it in chat as we were going along. But anyone who was watching afterwards, I hope you guys had fun and I hope you guys um, enjoyed the episode anyway. So, I'm, I'm gonna leave it here. I'm gonna go. I'll be back with more video games in the morrow. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow I think it's a uh, totally accurate battle simulator is going up. I recorded an episode of that right before I did this, so I hope you guys enjoy that. But for now, I'm gonna leave it there. That's the end of The Walking Dead, and I'm so glad it's over, and I'm glad that we got a nice, happy ending out of it. I hope you guys enjoyed it too, but thanks, guys. I'll, I'll see you, I'll see you in the gamer land! Goodbye!